how to play Hitmonkey in six minutes or less. Hitmonkey is the newest skill to enter the contest as of this video, and he is a little furry ball of fun that is easy to play and easy to learn. He comes with some great utility and a familiar play style. His attack, crit rate, and crit damage are above average, but his defensive stats are below average, and his ability to take damage is, well, abysmal. Hitmonkey has two monkey schemes that he can use. They are activated by a specific action you complete after landing three critical hits in a row. Landing critical hits is easy because Hitmonkey's first medium, first light, and second medium attacks are all guaranteed critical hits. So most of the time you'll be performing three hit combos. Every time you land three critical hits in a row, you will bleed your opponent for 4.5 seconds and you'll build up the critical hit counter. Add one of these dead pools to the team and you will get a burst of bleed damage to opponents on immunity nodes. While you are building up your critical hit counter, there will be an indicator here to tell you where you currently are. Once you have completed three hits, then you will get a monkey scheme icon that is ready to be converted by your next action. If you block or dex out of the next attack, then you'll activate Assassin's Cunning for 8 seconds. While the Assassin's Cunning is up, you will shut down your opponent's evade and have a flat 60% chance to evade attacks if you are not blocking. If you do evade, it will remove the Assassin's Cunning from Hitmonkey. Hitmonkey's bleed debuffs also have a chance to become critical bleeds based off your crit rating, making them more potent at any of these champs to increase your critical rating. Also, more critical hits you land in a row in the 8 second assassin cunning window, the more chances you have to activate critical bleeds. To activate Primal Rage for 8 seconds, your immediate action after getting Monkey Scheme needs to be striking your opponent, getting hit, or hitting into the block. While Primal Rage is active, Hitmonkey will ignore armor and resistance. Light attacks and specials will have a flat 20% chance to disorient the opponent, lowering the defensive ability accuracy by 40% for 6 seconds if applied from a light attack or 9 seconds if applied from a special. If Hitmonkey has a damage over time or stun debuff on him, then Primal Rage will be consumed and one instance of each debuff will be removed, making him very suicide friendly. When running suicides, I prefer to start the fight with a parry, medium, medium, and then back out and go in for a three hit combo to activate Primal Rage and remove the suicide debuffs. If an opponent evades, Assassin's Cunning will automatically activate for 15 seconds, preventing further evasion even if Primal Rage is already active. This scenario allows both to be active at the same time. Being knocked down will also activate both for 6 seconds, and when fighting any champion with the hashtag mercenary tag, both Assassin's Cunning and Primal Rage will activate after a 3 critical hit combo, regardless of the action you take after the monkey scheme has been activated. Hitmonkey Special 1 will activate Vigilance if Assassin's Cunning is up and cannot miss. This can be useful against champs such as Hood and Ghost. If Primal Rage is active, then it will become unblockable. If Hitmonkey Special 1 is successful in either breaking a blocking target or bypassing a miss, then Assassin's Cunning and Primal Rage will refresh and you will keep the Vigilance buff till they expire. There are only specific scenarios where the Special 1 is useful, so I prefer to go to the Special 2 because it is the damage dealer. If launched after a critical hit, then all hits of the Special 2 will be critical. Assassin's Cunning and Primal Rage will be paused while the Special 2 is active. Hitmonkey Special 3 will give him a cruelty buff for 27 seconds, increasing his critical damage while this buff is up. Both Assassin's Cunning and Primal Rage will pause for one third of a second while hitting the opponent, allowing you to extend their duration if you play aggressively enough. His signature ability is nice but not needed. While the opponent is above 25% health or is a hashtag mercenary, Primal Rage and Assassin's Cunning will last between 0.5 and 3.5 seconds longer. So at SIG 200, they will be active for 11.5 seconds if activated from Monkey Scheme or up to 18.5 if activated by your opponent evading. If Hitmonkey is awakened, he will also reduce defensive ability accuracy by 10 to 40% while the opponent is below 25% health or is tagged a hashtag mercenary. Playing Hitmonkey is pretty simple. I always start the fight with a medium-medium combo, then a medium-light-medium combo to activate the Primal Rage and to get rid of the bleed and poison from the suicides. Then I prefer to keep him in Primal Rage unless I am fighting an evading champ and need the assassins cunning up. Hitmonkey does great damage in either scheme. I rarely use the special one. For longer fights, I prefer to build up to the special three for the cruelty buff and play aggressively enough to launch the special two after a critical hit for some sweet damage. But in reality, you can zerg down most opponents with a few special twos. For even more damage, add any of these champs to the team and critical hits have a 30% chance to armor break for six seconds. Add OG Spidey to the team and you will automatically have the Assassin's Mastery or it will activate at 25% health instead of 18% health if you already have it. 
The masteries I feel great for him are precision and cruelty for harder hitting crits and more chances at critical bleeds, deep wounds, despair, and assassin. But that is it. That is how to play Hit Monkey in six minutes or less. Let me know how do you play Hit Monkey? Do you prefer to keep him in Assassin's Cunning or Primal Rage? Do you like his crit bleeds? Is he the Corvus of the skill class? Let me know in the comments below and let's discuss. As always, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you guys liked what you saw and you want to see more, please remember to like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter and hit me up in the Discord chat. Thanks, guys.